So was Jesus the Messiah or was he not the Messiah? Did he die on the cross and was resurrected on the third day? Or did he go into some sort of deep yogic trance? Or did he simply have a near-death experience like 7,000 people do every day in this country? Was he born of a virgin mother? Or was he conceived naturally just like everybody else? I have no idea. And the more research I've done into this project, the less inclined I am to believe anything. See, the problem with belief systems is that once you start believing something, you stop seeking the truth because you think you've already found it. But you can't get the truth from a book or a film or a teacher. You can only get the truth from one place, and that's deep within yourself. All those other things can do is help till the soil and prepare you for your own personal journey into self-inquiry. The rest is up to you. I do know this much. The more that I've meditated, the more richness and texture I've been able to get out of the things that Jesus said. He was a phenomenal man, arguably the greatest Jewish teacher ever. And he said a lot of really amazing things. And perhaps the most poignant and simplest of all was when he said, seek the truth. The truth will set you free. And so I urge you, I implore you, to learn how to meditate. And then when you do, from that sense of knowingness or gnosis, then go back and read the Quran and the Torah and the Bible and the Bhagavad Gita and the Upanishads. And when you do, what you'll discover is that each of these books says exactly the same thing. And that when we open up for an interfaith dialogue to discuss our differences, what you'll realize is that we don't have any. Just different ways of expressing divinity, which at the end of the day is a futile attempt to express the inexpressible anyway. Isn't it about time we stopped killing each other in the name of God? Your God is superior to my God? My way of connecting to divinity is better than yours? I mean, what is that about? Can we agree right now to choose a future of peace and harmony for all of mankind?